Pregnant Meghan Markle makes surprise solo appearance at college campus in London. Meghan Markle had a top secret meeting in London on Wednesday. The royal mom to be, who is expecting her first child with Prince Harry, spoke with a group of students and leaders at King's College London as part of the Association of Commonwealth Universities ACU, to discuss the importance and impact of higher education. In a photo shared by the ACU, Meghan, who was dressed in a black dress and pink coat with her hair in curls, was seated at the head of the table as she appeared to take notes and listen to other speakers. Today we brought together university leaders, academics and hashtag students to discuss how we can build a better world through hashtag hired. We were honored to be joined by HRH the Duchess of Sussex, the ACU tweeted, thanks at the underscore ACU for bringing us together. We had an excellent discussion about how research can tackle the problems of slavery and human trafficking. Thanks to HRH Duchess of Sussex for joining us, said Laura Hammond a professor of development studies at SOS University London. Since she was bestowed with her HRH title, Meghan has used her platform to focus on education and female empowerment. During her tour of Fiji with Harry in October, Meghan made her first ever royal speech, during which she confidently delivered a strong and inspiring message about the importance of empowering women through education. Everyone should be afforded the opportunity to receive the education they want but more importantly the education they have the right to receive. And for women and girls in developing countries, this is vital, she said. When girls are given the right tools to succeed, they can create incredible futures, not only for themselves but for all of those around them. And while progress has been made in many areas across the Commonwealth, there is always scope to offer more opportunities to the next generation of young adults and specifically to young women. She also reflected on her own college experience at Northwestern University in Evanston, Illinois, where she double majored in theater and international relations, and was a member of Kappa Kappa Gamma sorority. It was through scholarships, financial aid programs and work-study where my earnings from a job on campus went directly towards my tuition, that I was able to attend university. And, without question, it was worth every effort. She continued, Meghan's visit to King's College London comes after she met with Michelle Obama for the first time privately on Monday evening at the London stop of the former First Lady's book tour, in support of her new memoir, Becoming, at the South Bank Centre. They spoke at length about the importance of supporting and empowering women across all cultures and communities, a source told the Evening Standard. They also talked about shared experiences of pregnancy and raising children plus shared causes including girls' education. Mrs. Obama previously discussed Meghan's power to make a difference, recently telling Good Housekeeping, What I'd say is that there's so much opportunity to do good with a platform like that, and I think Meghan can maximize her impact for others, as well her own happiness, if she's doing something that resonates with her personally. Meanwhile, on Wednesday, Meghan's father-in-law, Prince Charles, was in her native country. The heir to the British throne, 70, and his wife Camilla, Duchess of Cornwall, 71, made his first U.S. visiting nearly four years for George H. W. Bush's funeral in Washington, D.C. Also in attendance was Bishop Michael Curry, the American bishop who memorably quoted Martin Luther King Jr. at Harry and Meghan's royal wedding in May.